Hey everyone, hope you're having a green day so far. I'm Steven Rosenberg and welcome. So today, what we're gonna be talking about is green businesses and why it makes sense to start thinking in that direction. I wanna make sure that it's clear to everybody that I am not some tree-hugging hippie. I am an eco-capitalist that helps businesses turn wasting money and materials and turn them into revenue generating machines, okay? So the next stage that I wanna talk about in doing that is really getting the, the company's culture on board. And that is one of the most challenging things depending on how many employees you have. Now I've done this for companies that have 10, 10 employees and I've done this for companies that have over a thousand employees at one single plant. And I can tell you that there will always be the naysayers, whether there's 10 or a thousand. So just accept that now. But then I also wanna talk about really putting a positive and incentivizing plan for them to be able to execute this over time. Do not have them come in Monday morning and all these things are changed and they don't know what's going on. People are very scared of change in general. So what you wanna do is start layering it in. So I suggest three months in advance, you start uh, talking about it softly. You know, whether you post it on the bulletin board, whether you do it in the cafeteria, whether you send out an email, whatever it is, but you're gonna start saying, you know, we as a company are starting to believe in this. We're really looking to explore it. Here are some of the goals. We are trying to roll out an incentive program. Does anybody have any ideas? please let us know. That way you're getting them involved, they have a say in it, they have an opportunity to voice their opinion, uh, everyone feels like they're a part of this because it is definitely a culture change. And I can tell you one thing, one sure way to make sure that it fails miserably is not getting management's buy-in. And when I say buy-in, I don't mean, oh yeah, go ahead and, and put those recycling bins out, I mean, they need to be the cheerleader for everyone else because if they see that you don't care about it, they're not gonna care about it. That's just the bottom line. Thanks so much for watching. Make sure you guys subscribe if you enjoy these videos. Leave some comments below. Check out some of the blog posts that I've written on this at stephentrosenberg.com. Go to the blog section or the YouTube section. And as always, have a green day.